so I just thought I'd hang out with you today. It's Tactical Tuesday and I was thinking about what to share with you. Um, I was thinking about what would be the most helpful to some of you guys and um, I think what would be a good place to start is to talk about money because money is the thing that's going to give you the choices that you want to have to be able to do the things that you want when you want on your terms you get the picture so I'm very comfortable about talking about money I've been a financial I'm an ex-financial advisor I was a financial advisor for over 10 years um, in banking and so from the age of like 19 I've been talking I'm giving away my age now I've been talking about money just comfortably and um, it's because of that that my association with money my money mindset is good you know it's in the right place but when I speak to certain people about money a lot of people get very uncomfortable they don't like talking about money um, they see it as a bad thing they see it as a scarce thing that they never have enough of and I do think it is a, is a mindset thing um, but I've raised quite a lot of money through um, helping people get a good return on their money through working with me in property developments or um, through joint venturing or you know doing a particular strategy like a flip or a buy refurb refinance blah 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 and I was thinking about why did they choose me what what made them feel comfortable about working with me um, so the first thing I want to say to you guys is in the property world um, money is plentiful and the reason it's plentiful is that people who don't know you who believe that you can actually do the strategy that you've trained and learned to do will give you money um, because they can take security over bricks and mortar they can take security over the building so it's less risky than investing in a startup business where if the business goes bust their money's gone whereas if if somebody was to invest in a um, investment property and it went wrong well they would have a charge over the building and they can get their money back out or a lot of it back out so it's, it's, it's kind of less risky um, but how do people choose who they'll work with over who they won't work with well I think it's important that you understand that you are so unique and special in your own way that you will um, be able to connect with certain people and types of people that maybe I never would be able to um, and I've noticed that there are particular types of people who want to work with me um, so I almost have my perfect investor avatar um, and they just tend to be very very similar in terms of age and what they're up to and the amount of money they have etc so for whatever reason I attract a particular type of investor which is great because it means that you know I'm happy with that I'm comfortable with that and I know um, what those people are looking for and you know it's quite easy to to work with the, the type of people that that usually want to work with me um, and I, I tend to stick to that type of investor avatar so I just want to reach out to you guys and I want to say that for those of you that don't know if you do take the time to put in the work which I know a lot of people aren't prepared to do but if you do put in the work because achieving financial freedom guys is not easy it's going to take everything it's going to require that you invest your time and energy and focus in you know really um, making it happen so if you if you know if people have got money and they want to work with somebody who's got a track record or perhaps if, even if you don't have a track record a deal is a deal you know if, if something stacks up and you can present it well people will invest with you so I just wanted to encourage you for those people that don't know you know in property money is in abundance um, if you find a particular strong um, investment deal or a particular um, package deal or a, a property that you know stacks up and you're able to communicate how it stacks up and what you would do with it well you you could change your life you know you can get investors and I think as long I just wanted to plant that seed that you don't have to be special you don't have to be you know a qualified ex-financial advisor you have just got to be good at um, communicating to other people what it is you do how you do it what's in it for them and follow through in your commitments and um, be so sure of, of what you're offering and people will lend you money um, so yeah that's what I wanted to share today that's all I'm gonna share today um, but yeah I just wanted to encourage you to yeah maybe take the time to work on what strategy you're doing 
and how to communicate that really well so that when the opportunity comes along, investor, strategy, marry, financial freedom, passive income, happy life. I was gonna say happy wife, happy life. <laughs> I mean, happy life. So um, yeah, I, I don't worry about you know raising money because I see it as an abundant thing. So if you don't, then I would encourage you to um, work on that. You know, and there's lots of free um, training programs that happen around the country um, with having the right money mindset. So if you want to know about those, then reach out to me. I can point you in the right direction. Um, but yeah, hope you're having a good week. Happy tactical. What's the day today? Tuesday. <laughs> Gosh. I've got a lot going on this week. I've just been to my sensitivity play and he was awesome. He was an angel, bless him. And um, yeah, I'm about to go and see Santa in a few hours as well. So, <laughs> But anyway, have a great week, guys. Speak to you soon.